On a cold Tuesday night, December 4th, 1906, seven young men had a vision which soon turned into a prestigious organization. Manly deeds, scholarships, and love for all mankind are the aims for which our fraternity was built on. Jewel, Henry Arthur Callis. Jewel, Charles Henry Chapman. Jewel, Eugene Kinkle Jones. Jewel, George Biddle Kelly. Jewel, Nathaniel Allison Murray. Jewel, Robert Harold Ogle. Jewel, Vertner Woodson Tandy. Are the founders of our dear fraternity. Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity, the oldest, the coldest, and the father of all black Greek organizations. The ceremonies began. Martin Luther King walked up to the podium on the steps of the Lincoln Memorial and began. I am happy to join with you today in what will go down in history as the greatest demonstration for freedom in the history of our nation. Five score years ago, a great American in whose symbolic shadow we stand today, signed the Emancipation Proclamation. This momentous decree came as a great beacon light of hope to millions of Negro slaves who had been seared in the flames of withering injustice. It came as a joyous daybreak to end the long night of their captivity. But 100 years later, we can never be satisfied as long as the Negro is the victim of the unspeakable horrors of police brutality. We cannot be satisfied as long as the Negro in Mississippi cannot vote, and the Negro in New York believes he has nothing for which to vote. States of America, and that's why we just won eight elections straight 
because the American people want to believe in change again. Don't tell me words don't matter. So I do talk about hope. We put hope on our signs. I delivered a speech in Boston about hope. I wrote a book called The Audacity of Hope. This notion that somehow hopes are false, that implies that hope is blind optimism, that you're passive, that you're waiting and sitting back for good things to happen, that you're shirking from a fight. That's not what hope is. Hope is not blind optimism. Hope is not ignoring the challenges that stand in your way. That nothing in this country worthwhile has ever happened except somebody somewhere was willing to hope. That's how this country was founded, by that greatest generation, by, by that group of patriots that declared independence against the mighty British Empire. Nobody gave them a chance. Cause here comes Dasa Vex Yeah, Michael, 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 Michael